Making accurate and consistent measurements serves as a foundation for a solid greenhouse. Here we have pounded a stake to serve as a corner marker. The crew is measuring our length of 96 feet. Holding our original corner, Adam is walking down with the tape to measure our diagonal, ensuring that we have a 90 degree square corner. We can use the Pythagorean theorem, a squared plus b squared equals c squared, to determine the diagonal measurement we need in order to have a square corner. A refers to our greenhouse width, 30 feet. B refers to our greenhouse length, which is 96 feet. If we square the width, multiplying it by itself, in this case 30 times 30, then square the length, which would be 96 times 96, add those together, and then we want to find the square root of that sum, which will give us the measurement in feet that our diagonal line needs to be to make sure the greenhouse is square. In this case, the measurement is 100 feet and 7 inches. Take this measurement at each corner of the greenhouse. Once you have each corner square, place those ground posts roughly every 4 feet down the length. With your corners marked, pull the measuring tape down the length of the greenhouse again, leaving it down. Make a mark every 4 foot on center, using the measuring tape as your guide. Adam uses paint in this case. With everything laid out, we're ready to start driving the ground posts.